Hello, good evening, everyone. Good evening. Tasting microphone. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, good evening, teacher. Hi, Ronald. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. Ah, there is Candy. Hello, Candy. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening. Thank okay, you. great. Are you feeling better? Yes, I feel excellent. <laughs> excellent. Nice. Okay, great. Yes. Very good. Very good. That is great. Okay, Marvin, Pineda, Eric, and Karen. Stephanie, welcome. Welcome, guys. Okay, good evening, good evening. Um, it's already 8 o'clock. Sí, sí, estaba, estoy cenando en el momento, no le puede contestar el momento. <laughs> okay, no problem. Okay, but I know that you are there. I listen to you. Okay, great. Excellent, guys. Uh, thank you for joining this class. This is the last week. Imagine the last week of the model. The last week of the model. And we are going to see a couple of things in, in a moment. Okay. Let's see. Just give me one moment because I need to open something in this moment. Okay, let's see. Okay, how are you doing with the platform? Are you doing great? Did you receive the, the message in your WhatsApp today, a few hours ago? Yes, I received the message. Okay, you received it. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Uh, I will explain that in, in a moment. So you, have, you can have um, more information about what is being requested in this moment. Okay, uh, welcome Maritza. Uh, Josman is joining, Ulisse is connected. Okay, what about the exercises? Uh, did you complete the section four? Did you complete it? The section four last week? Not yet. Not yet. Yes. Oh, you gotta, you gotta run, my friend. You gotta run a little bit. Tiene que correr un poquitito ahí. Um, okay, perfect, perfect. For the ones who have not finished, I, I remind you that section four needs to be completed, okay? It should be completed at this moment. Uh, let's see, Maritza, hello, Carolina Elizabeth. Uh, Daniel Laines, Marcela Rodriguez, welcome, welcome, guys. This is the last week of classes. Imagine very fast. Okay, mm, let me see the the thing that I am looking for in the chat because I don't find it. But before that, okay, before that, I can leave it for later. I will I will share a video about Insaforp, it's an introductory video that we are going to watch. Okay, Juan Carlos is joining Ada too. George Lemos. Okay, and Karen and Stephanie too. Okay, I will, I will share my computer, my monitor in this moment. Uh, okay, sharing, sharing, okay. Confirm that you can see my monitor. Confirm, please. I okay, okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, uh, I will play the video uh, that we have for tonight. It's about three minutes and in, in three and a half. Okay, three and a half minutes. It's not long. Okay, we are gonna watch it in this moment. Your attention, please. Do you hear the sound? Yes. Does it have sound? Yes. Okay, cool. El Insafor ha trabajado con un alto nivel de profesionalismo, pensando siempre en incrementar las posibilidades de crecimiento para la gente de nuestro país. 
nos hemos dedicado a que a través de la formación se generen oportunidades para los salvadoreños y así cada vez más, en un mundo más competitivo y globalizado, siempre existan en nuestro país posibilidades de superación para todos. Miles de hombres y mujeres han logrado desarrollarse profesionalmente y han ampliado sus conocimientos y posibilidades laborales a través de los diferentes programas de formación que son parte del Sistema de Formación Profesional, el cual ofrece programas de formación para todos los niveles de recurso humano dentro de una empresa. Se ha incrementado productividad de muchas industrias y cientos de empresas a través de la capacitación y formación de cientos de miles de salvadoreños con programas como Área Técnica, ofreciendo cursos técnicos para mejorar el desempeño operativo y tecnológico de los trabajadores. Competencias Gerenciales, con temas de capacitación para complementar y actualizar conocimientos para áreas de gerencia. Inglés para el Trabajo, contenidos estandarizados del inglés para hacer a los trabajadores más eficientes y productivos en el desempeño de sus funciones. Mejora de Competitividad de las MIPES. Amplios temas de capacitación, específicos para micro y pequeños empresarios. Cursos cerrados y abiertos, tratando temas de capacitación para trabajadores de las empresas cotizantes de Insaforp. Insaforp Online, cursos online con el horario y ubicación que más convenga al usuario para la constante capacitación en múltiples temas y profesiones. Además, el Insaforp también genera oportunidades para los jóvenes y los salvadoreños en condiciones de vulnerabilidad, ofreciendo para ellos cursos de formación inicial para que más salvadoreños puedan crecer y desarrollarse con programas como Hábil Técnico Permanente ofrece la enseñanza de técnicas y destrezas en diferentes oficios, complementando el conocimiento técnico con competencias blandas necesarias para desempeñar un trabajo. Empresa Centro es un exitoso programa que utiliza la modalidad de formación dual, ofreciendo carreras técnicas que combinan clases teóricas con prácticas en empresas con un alto porcentaje de empleabilidad. El proyecto Caminos de la Juventud forma a jóvenes en condiciones de vulnerabilidad que han finalizado el bachillerato, brindando formación vocacional, habilidades para el trabajo y emprendedurismo. Proyectos especiales. Los proyectos especiales son aquellas acciones de formación que incorporan a otros actores e integran elementos complementarios, como desarrollo humano, articulación con proyectos productivos, financiamiento de herramientas y equipo básico para el autoempleo. Trabajando con el compromiso claro de ayudar al desarrollo del país y con un equipo profesional entregado a buscar oportunidades para nuestra gente, es que Insafor ha logrado tener un modelo de gobernanza y gestión ejemplar que tiene como base el diálogo permanente entre el sector empleador, laboral y el gobierno, formando a los trabajadores, capacitando a la gente de nuestro país. Es que transformamos la vida de las familias salvadoreñas, porque en Insafor trabajamos todos los días sabiendo que, a través del conocimiento, es que estamos formando un mejor El Salvador. Okay, that was a video. Very interesting. A lot of careers and things that you can study in this company. Very good. El Salvador. Okay. okay, that was it. No more. Okay, that was a video. And let's see if we can see the... Okay, it's still sizing back. Okay, it's not showing yet. Okay, uh, guys, so welcome to the class at 13. 13, imagine, only four classes more. And sorry, I'm really sorry to say goodbye to you in, in four classes. Imagine, very fast. Okay, guys, uh, thank you. I will, uh, I will see, let me see. Okay, I will share the, the class, today's class. And welcome, today's class of 13. Okay, I will pass this because we know it. At this moment, we know all the indications and in that info too. Okay, in the four areas. Correct? The four areas of, we need to practice. Okay, and the tools that you can use. Uh, later, I will upload uh, the class in, in the Google Drive link. Okay, uh, today's topic is, today's topic to practice is? Where to be? Simple fact. 
verb to be simple past. Yeah, correct. The verb to be in simple past. Okay, if you remember, in other classes, we have been practicing this, okay, doing questions, uh, reading. Do you remember the reading about Shakespeare? Yes, in simple past. Yeah. Do you? Do you remember the Shakespeare? Shakespeare activity, reading activity. Yeah. Yes, okay, in simple past, okay? It has simple past structures, okay? But today we are gonna practice a little bit uh, in this class, okay? And the question that is on the screen is... Where were you born? Where were you born, okay? And born, what is born for you? What is born? What is that? Okay. Okay. okay, born by itself, is yes nacer but the complete verb i will show you the complete verb it goes like this uh let me see Nasi. the complete uh no i mean the verb in in the normal in the normal structure is to be to be born okay that is the verb to be born nacer to be born not only born Okay, this to be born, that is a complete verb in, in this case. Okay, great. And the answer is, the answer is? I was born is in was born in El Salvador. Is or what is the subject? Me. I, 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 I was born in El Salvador. In El Salvador. Yeah. Okay, very good. Imagine you are traveling around the world and the guy at the airport, Asks you where where were you born, Neulise? Where were you born, sir? Where were you born? Uh, excuse me. Uh, I, I was born. born. Correct. Uh -huh. okay. Complete. I was yeah. born. I was born I... in El Salvador. <laughs> okay. Imagine at the airport, the guy is checking you the passport because you want to travel. Okay. I was born. Where were you born? Uh, Ronald, okay, now mention the department that you were born. Mention the department, San Miguel, Santana, etc. Ronald, where were you born? I was born in the San Michael city. San Michael. And El Salvador, yes. we have San Michael. What is the real name? <laughs> San Miguel. San Miguel, San okay. Miguel. Okay, normal, normal names because in in our department we use the normal names okay great where were you born karen and stephanie in which city where were you born born in 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 city san salvador in san salvador city okay in san salvador marcela rodriguez where were you born Born in the Huachapan city? In, in a Huachapan, okay, city. Okay, I was born. Juan Carlos, where were you born? Yes, I was born in Ciudad Delgado in El Salvador. Ah, okay, Ciudad Delgado, okay, great, cool. I know the place. Marvin Pineda, where were you born? I was born in Ciudad City. Okay, so yeah, so yeah, city hall. Okay, Ada Marilu, and what about you? Where were you born? A microphone, microphone is not activated. I was born in La Paz, El Salvador. Ah, La Paz, El Salvador. Josman, where were you born, Josman? I was born in Sonsonate. Oh, okay, Sonsonate. Is it hot, Sonsonate? Hot? Yes, it's hot. It is, yes, I remember. Okay, great. Nice, Rene. And what about you, Rene? Where were you born? I was born, born in Olocuilta City. Oh, Pupusa City Hall. Okay, yes. Olocuilta. <laughs> ah, they're delicious. They are very delicious. Osmin Rivera, next. Good night, teacher. I was born in Ciudad Arce. 
Chuvarse, okay, okay, great. And Daniela Ines, where were you born? I was born in San Salvador City. Okay, very good. Excellent. Okay, Karen Villegas is in class. Karen, are you? Karen, Karen Villegas, are you? Okay, where were you born, Karen? Okay, maybe you have issues with the microphone. No problem. Osmin, the last one, Osmin Rivera. Where were you born? Okay, yes, uh, yes. I was born in Ciudad Arce, teacher. Okay, Ciudad Arce, too. Okay, excellent. Very good. Okay, see, it's pretty simple to use. Bird to be in simple past. Yes. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, uh, Karen. I was born in San Salvador City. Okay, in San Salvador. More specifically, where? What part of San Salvador? What? What? What part in San Salvador? What part? Uh, uh, City. <laughs> okay, the city. Okay, city. Okay, in the city center. Okay, good. Good, good, guys. Excellent. Very good. Let's see. Uh, sentence, sentence there. Can you? Can you make simple past questions with bird to be? Okay. One question in with a bird to be. Any of you, cualquiera, any of you can make it in simple past. Uh -huh. Any question in simple past using the bird to be. Make me one question with the verb to be in simple past. Let's see. Simple past. You can type it. You can use a chat if you don't have microphone. Or you can speak. You, if you speak, it's better. Remember that you are practicing your English. Simple past. Question in simple past. Any, any type of question. No? No, 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 no. Yes, yes, yes. Any type of questions in uh, simple past? Simple past? Uh, uh -huh, simple past of the verb to be. Verb to be. Okay. Uh, yesterday I was very, very happy. Ah, okay, good. Okay, that is a good sentence. Um, okay, but that is affirmative. That is, I was. I was is affirmative, remember? I was, you were. Question. Ah, yeah, question. Yeah. Okay. To the beach. Okay, you were to the beach. Uh, okay, is that correct? You were to the beach. Okay, correct or incorrect? Huh? Opinions, opinions. When you go to the beach. Uh, okay, you were. Let's work with where. You were to the beach. Okay. Is that correct or incorrect? It's incorrect. Uh, okay, it's uh, it's not totally incorrect, but the structure oh, yeah, yeah. for the questions is that you move, you move the verb to be at the beginning. Yes, at the beginning yeah. of the sentence. Ah, okay, because this is this is a affirmative yeah. sentence. You were, you were at. Okay, and the word is at. Okay, good. But because it is a question, we need where at the beginning, and then the the subject. The subject, correct, and the complement. Where you, okay, can you repeat it, uh, Ada Marilu? Can you repeat in in this part? Where you at the beach, and you can add, puede agregar, you can, uh -huh. Okay, read it again, please, read it again. Where you at the beach yesterday? Uh, okay, negative guys, uh, negative, negative is? Where is? I wasn't. I did. I did. I did. Okay, yes or no? No, I wasn't. No, correct. No, I wasn't. Wasn't, correct. Wasn't. wasn't because the question is directly for you and you answer and you answer back. Contesta de regreso. Okay, you answer back. Okay. Great, this is the, co the correct structure for questions. Remember, verb to be first, then subject, and the rest, complement and the question mark. Okay, let's see, let's practice a little bit. Let's practice to refresh. Uh, oh, okay, we are in this part. One, two, and three. Check. 
Check, check. Check the next picture. Check the next picture. Check the next picture. The next picture. My question is for the board. The board. The board. The board. Ask. Okay, answer, repeat answer, answer. Okay, okay, do you recognize the picture? Yes? Yes. Do you? Okay, cool. Okay, what is the correct question in this case about him? Who was Cantinflas? Ah, okay, no, was who Cantinflas? No, right? Who was Cantinflas? Who was, correct, okay. Who, okay, let's order, who? Who was Cantinflas? Aha, uh -huh. who was? Who was Cantinflas? And the answer, what is the answer? He, he, he was, was an actor. An actor. He was? An actor. And in nationality, the nationality, Cantinflas nationality. Mexican. Mexican. Okay, Mexican. Mexican. Mm -hmm. He was a Mexican. Ah, no, and right? And uh, is incorrect. Ah, yeah, because the next letter is consonant, is not vowel, correct. Ah, uh, Mexican actor. Okay, cool. Yeah, verb to be in the question, the correct structure and the correct structure for the affirmative sentence. Okay, good, good. Okay, very good. That is the correct one. About Canteen Flans. Do you like Canteen Flans movies? Yes. Yes, I do. Okay, yes, you do. Okay, perfect. Okay, great. Yeah, he was a very nice actor. Okay, he was, remember, he was. Simple pass of the verb to be. Next, next uh, picture. Let's see it. Next picture is this one. Okay, what is the correct sentence? Where were you born? Ah, okay. Where were you born? Okay. Where to where, right? But one word about the place, and the second word is uh, the verb to be correct in simple past. Where were next? You born. You born. Born. Where were you born? Correct. Where were you born? And the answer is. I was born in Salvador. Okay, okay, great. I was born in El Salvador. In El Salvador, okay, correct. And this is the correct structure in the question. Uh -huh, there it is. And the structure in the answer. Very good. Okay, that is correct. Next one. What is the next one? Okay, look at the picture. And what is the date? What is the date that is showing? Sunday, July 24th. Okay, repeat Sunday. 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 Aha. Sunday. Repeat it Sunday. Sun, Sunday. like this. Sunday. Sunday. Correct. Sunday. Okay. Okay, very good. Sunday, July. July. 20, 24th. 24th. Okay. And that was, that was yesterday. Okay. Yesterday, Sunday. Okay. And the question, how is the question the correct, the correct order for the question? Okay. Tell me guys, participate. Huh? Where were you in the morning? Yes, where were you? Uh, what is Max? What is what is next? Yesterday. In in the morning yesterday. In the morning yesterday. Ah, okay. Where were you in the morning yesterday? And the answer, the answer, the answer. I was. I okay. Correct. Oh. The... Yes, I was. Yeah, I was. Uh -huh. I it was. is correct. Yes, I was. Now mention the place. At home. At home. What else? Um, let's At see. The beach. At the beach. You can mention any place. Daniel made the question for for Monica. Daniela Ines make the question for Monica. This one. Make it. Make it. Make it. Repeat it. 
Uh, where were you in the morning yesterday? Okay. I was I was in the alegría. Okay, I was in in alegría. In alegría is that mm, oh. Usulután. Ah, Usulután. Yeah. Okay. Ah, okay, nice. Alegría. Okay, good. Okay, great. Okay, very good. See? Ver to be first. Primero ver to be first. Ver to be and then. And then. WH question first. Then the ver to be. Open or close question. Mm, close question. Uh, uh, open. open. No, it's open. an open question. Yeah, open because question. you are yes. requesting information. So it's it's open. Yes. Where? What place? What place in El Salvador? Where were you? Okay. Where to be after the WH? That is the difference between the open question, okay, and close. That is the difference. In close question, there is no WH word, okay? No WH. See, this is open, open question, okay? And this one is open or close? It's open question. Open question, okay? Because you need you need information from someone that is asking you. Okay, great. Let's see. The next one would be, okay, if you see where to be in the question, where to be in the answer. Okay, next, come on. Next question. What is the picture? Look at the picture. Okay, check the picture, evaluate it, and check it. It is a park. Uh -huh. they, they were in the park. In the park. Ah, okay. The, hmm. the question. How is the question? I need a question. No affirmative. Question. No affirmative. Where are they? Where are they? Where? Where, the uh -huh. Where are they? In the park. In the park. In the Where park. Are they in the park? Okay. Close or open question in, in this moment. No, it's no question. No. It's okay. close because you only need two options. The first it's option open. is open. Uh, no, it's not open. It's not an open question. It's a close question. It's a close, uh, close question. Because he's asking, uh, where were the children in the park? Look at look at the picture. Our child, do you see any children at the park in this moment? No. 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 no, right? No, there there are no children, no parents, no children. The place is empty, 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 vacío. Okay. The place... Excuse me. Ah, okay. The answer. What is the answer? The answer is. Uh huh. Where no. they? No. No, they no. weren't. Correct. They were. No, they weren't. Were weren't. No, they weren't. Okay, no. See, no people. So it's negative. You are saying, no, teacher, there are no, there were no people at the park. Okay, according with the picture. Okay, very good. See, close or open? Mm -hmm. It's close question. It's close because you only close need. Question. Yeah, two options or yes or no. Okay, only two options. That's why is a closed question. Okay, perfect. Very good. In the last picture, okay, check check the picture. Check it carefully. Now, what is the correct question? The correct order in the question. Okay, there are many words in this part. There are many words. He was. Uh, he was is affirmative. I need to make a, the question. Was, was ah, okay, correct. Was, was, uh -huh. was, was he? Listening. What is next? What is next after listening? To, to, to music. With headphones. With, with, with headphones. With headphones. Okay. 
And that was it? No more. No more. Was he, can you repeat it? Can you read it? Was he listening? To was music he listening to music with headphones? Okay, very good. Yeah. Okay, you are using all the words. Was was he? Here it is. He listening, listening to to music, uh, music with with headphones. No more words, right? Okay. Okay, what is missing in questions? What is missing? ¿Qué falta? Question mark. Ah, the question mark. Okay, the question mark. Don't forget it, because if you forget it, no complete question. You need to use it. You need to add it. Okay, and the answer is? Yes, he was. Yes. He was. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Ah, okay, yes, he was. Correct. Open or close question with the verb to be? It's close question. Open. Open. Close. Open or close? Open. Close Open question. Close. Close uh, question. Okay, this is a close question because close you question. only you only need two options or yes or no. Okay, can you make it open? How can you make it open? How can you make it open question? The same when one. Two to that question. Uh, okay, when someone said when, alguien dijo when, someone said when, when, uh -huh. when, can you read it? When was is a question, open question. Okay, when was, because, is that correct, when was? Because, uh, tiene dos W. Uh, two W, okay, when was he listening to music eight. with headphones? Okay, the question is correct. Okay, the question is correct. You are asking about about time what time but it's better if you say what time it's better mejor okay what time what uh -huh. yeah. what time what? can you read it read the question please what time we need the music with headphones okay so we don't need this we don't need this answer because it's not a closed question anymore now it's open question. And for open question, what would it be the answer? What would it be the answer for this question? Uh -huh. He was mm -hmm. listening to music. He was listening, okay, to music. What time? Today at 7 p.m. Today at, at seven, okay, or in the morning, you can say in the, ah, in the morning, he was listening to music in the morning very early, okay? Okay, good. So now is an open question because you are using the WH, WH word, see what? Okay, and that is the difference, basically. That is the difference between open or closed question, okay? Very good. That was the answer, okay? Doubts? Doubts? Yes? No? No. No doubts? No. Are you sure? No. Okay, yeah. perfect. Perfect then. Perfect. Okay. Let's see. Next slide. Let's see what else we have. Okay. Fair to be simple past. This is? This is the, this is the complete structure of fair to be. In the simple past. In the simple past. Okay. If you if you practice this, okay, I don't tell you memorize. No le digo memorize because that sometimes is not a hundred percent sure. But if you practice, if you practice, if you repeat, if you review, okay, an hour a day, okay, and you you remember better because memorizing not so good. Okay. Affirmative, what is the affirmative in the simple past? What is the structure in the simple past? Affirmative. Subject. Subject. Uh, but uh, the structure, I mean, not the formula because you might know, puede que ya se la sepa, but uh -huh. how do I say in affirmative sentences? Was for in my salon. Was, uh -huh. what else? I, you were. Yeah. Okay, let's repeat it. Let's repeat it. You were. He was. He was. He was. He was. He was. He 
It was. It was. We were. We were. We were. And they were. Okay, check. And in the affirmative, the subject goes first and then the verb to be. Okay, in affirmative. In negative, contraction. In negative, let's remember. I, I wasn't. Uh -huh. You weren't. He wasn't. He wasn't. It wasn't. Mm -hmm. You weren't. We weren't. And they weren't. They weren't correct. That is the structure. See, it's pretty simple. If you if you pay attention closely, if you concentrate, it's pretty simple. Yes, you follow. You follow the same. I was affirmative. Negative. I. No, I was. Okay, no, don't say no, that is a mistake. Uh, I will correct it. I don't need no, no necessito no. I, I, wasn't. I wasn't, correct, I wasn't. You? Okay, you weren't, you, you weren't. he? He wasn't, mm -hmm. he wasn't, it wasn't. Correct. Only one person repeating. Hey, I have, I don't know how many students I have, but only one is repeating. Come on. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. We weren't in. They weren't. They weren't. Correct. Okay. That is a negative. Simple. Is it simple or difficult? Uh huh. It's simple. It's simple. Yes. What you need is practice. That. That. Only that. Practice. Okay. In question. What is the structure in question? Was I? Was I? Uh -huh. Was you? Was he? Was he? Mm -hmm. Was it? Were you? Uh, were we? And uh, were they? And were they? Okay, that is the structure. Correct. Was I? Were you? Mm -hmm, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, very good. See? Where and was. Only two in simple past. In the simple present, they are three, but it's not difficult neither. Okay, great. See, that is very easy, easy to follow. Okay. In the question, in the question, the verb to be goes first. See, in closed questions, not in open questions, only in closed questions, the verb to be goes first. Okay. Understood? Understood? Yes. Entendido? Yes. Got it? You got yes. it? Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, what I tell you, look at the What I tell you, you only need practice repeating, making some conversation with someone, making sentences, and listening too. Listening. Okay, can you? Can you answer simple past question? Past question with the to be. Okay, can you answer simple past questions with the verb to be, guys? Uh -huh. What is the answer to this question? What is the answer? Can you answer simple past questions with the verb to be? I was. Uh, uh -huh. Yes. Yes, I can. Yes, yes I can. Yes, I, can. Yes, I can. No was, because if you see, do you see verb to be in simple past in the question? Do you see the simple past of the verb to be in the question? Yes or no? Hello, hello. Mm. Do you see the verb to be in simple past in the question? Oh, yes. Okay. Uh huh. Yes or no? Do you see it? Do you see the verb to be in simple past in this question? Where? Where is the simple past of the verb to be in the question? In which part? In which part is it? Don't decide the simple past. I am not. Um, no, the question doesn't have. The question is with. Part. Can, can the question is part? with. No. Can you? Ah, can you? Okay. Can you? Can you? Usted puede. Ah. Can you answer simple past questions with the verb to be? Uh -huh, is the answer is yes, no. I do. Uh, yes, do yes, where, where yes, is do? Let's see. Yes, yes, I can. Mm, ah, okay. Ah, okay. That is uh, the the answer. 
That is the answer. The thing is that you you need to identify the the verb that the question has. Okay, identify. Okay. Uh -huh. So the answer is yes. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Correct. Yes, I can. Okay. Very good. I am not using auxiliary, no verb to be, any other verb, but I am using can. Yes, I can. Perfect. Okay, be careful with that. Sometimes we we answer mechanically. Algunas veces contestamos mechanically. Yes, I do, but the question is with with can and you for this yeah. for in this case, correct? Okay. That is only attention. Identify the verb and then answer the question. Okay. Okay, very good. Am I am I correct? Am I listen, am I correct with explanation? Am I correct? Mm -hmm. Am I correct with explanation? Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, you are. Yes, yes, you are. Perfect, perfect. Yes, you are. Correct. Because I am asking you with the verb to be in simple present and you answer with the simple present. See? Simple present, simple present. Okay, great. Okay, excellent. Let's see what else we have. Uh, remember, if you, if you have questions, uh, ask them. Ask them, please. Okay, let's copy this link. And we're gonna practice some questions about the verb to be in simple past. Let me open it. Copy, paste. Uh, okay, is it raining where you live in this moment? Listen, is it raining where you live in this moment? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Huh? yes correct. It's raining. Yes, yes, it is. Yes. Okay, very good. Yes, it is. Excellent. Okay. That is how you can answer. Paying attention to the question and then answer. Okay, yes, it is. Perfect. Uh, open. What is what is the game? Open the box. There's a really simple class question. Okay, the indication says. I'm going to Question use the verb plus to be in plus or negative or open. Okay. Questions can be closed or or open. Okay, we have two options: closed questions and open questions. Okay, let's see. Uh, the first, the first participant. It would be Juan Carlos Rosales. Uh, yes, Eric, I see your hand raised. Yes, Eric. I have a problem with my connection. Oh, okay. If you have issues with your microphone or with the signal, it's okay. No problem. You can use a chat. Okay. If you want to make any question, you can use a chat. Okay, perfect. Uh, Juan, Juan Carlos, are you are you ready, Juan Carlos, for the first one? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, excellent. Yes, I am. Very good. Okay, let's see the chat. Thanks. No problem. Okay. Okay, after the claps. Okay, select one number, please. Select one or choose. Um, three. Number three. Okay. Uh, you're going to read the question for a classmate. Okay. Okay. Is that right? Right. Okay. Right. Perfect. Number, you said three, right? Three, right. Okay. Great. Read the question and mention the who is the question for. Quick soccer team was the winner in the previous champion league. Uh -huh. Question is for? For whom? Um, Real Madrid? 
Ah, okay. Someone answered it. Okay, already. Okay. But that is only the complement. That is only one part of the three parts that we need to answer. The complete answer is? Uh -huh. Subject, verb, complement. Mm -hmm. The, the team the, was winner the, the team, team Real Madrid. The soccer team winner. Correct. The soccer team winner oh, is uh, Real Madrid. Real. No, is a Real Madrid. Uh, okay. okay. What is what is the form? What is the form of the simple of the verb to be in the question? What is the form? Simple present, future, simple past. Simple past. Ah, okay. So the end, the correct answer is repeat it. Try to repeat it. The soccer, the soccer team, team winner. winner. What? The winner soccer team. Uh -huh. The winner soccer team. What? Was. Was. Correct. Because the question has was. The question has what? Was. was who? Was Real Madrid. The Real Madrid. Was. Correct. Yes. Okay, and that was the correct answer. Okay, check. Check where to be simple past. Okay, let's see, Candy, select a number. And guys, if you know the answer, you can answer it, of course. Candy, which number? Number uh, six. Six, okay. Can you read the question? Was your father at home last night? Guys, for the rest, what is the answer for that question? No, he was. No. Uh -huh. If you say no. Was he? No, no, yes. I mean the answer, the answer in negative. Okay, someone said no. Alguien dijo no before. Someone said no. No, he was, no. no he, he was. wasn't. Okay, okay. You gotta you gotta pronounce uh, wasn't very clearly. No, he wasn't. Okay, someone's microphone is causing. Okay, thank you, Daniel. Okay, great. Next. Okay, uh, I will request help from Ingrid, Vanessa. Are you in class, Ingrid? I see yeah. your name. Aha, uh -huh. okay, there you are. Which number? Number seven. Seven. Read the question, please. Was your teacher sleeping at 11 p.m. last night? Answer. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, he was. He was. Yes, he was. Perfect. Yeah. Was your teacher? So that's me. A sleepy. <gasps> Who at at what time? Yes, he was. Eleven yes, p.m. Was. Eleven p.m. Very late. Late. Kind of late. So I was correct. I was sleepy yesterday at that time. Okay. Great. Excellent. Uh, Carolina Elizabeth is in class. Are yeah. you? Yes, perfect, perfect. Okay, which number would you uh, like to five. open? Which one? Five. Five, uh, number five. Read the question, please. Mm -hmm. Who was your best co-worker co in your previous job? Previous, previous. previous job. Okay. Mm -hmm. Who was who was your best coworker in your previous job? What is coworker? What's that? Compañero de trabajo. Ah, okay, okay. Now, guys, uh, or you can answer too, Ingrid. Who was your best coworker in your previous job? In your previous, not in this moment. It's previous job. Mm. Mm -hmm. Who My... was? My best co-worker was Raimundo. Raimundo, okay, the famous Raimundo. Okay, perfect, very good. That is the answer. My best co-worker in my previous job was, and then you send the name. 
Okay, excellent. That is a correct answer. Okay, next, uh, let's see. Ada, Ada, hello, Ada, are you in class yet? Ada Morilu, nope. Marcela, hello, Marce, are you in class yet? Yes. Okay, perfect. What number? What number would you like to open? Number one. One. Okay, mm -hmm. read the question, please. Okay, read. Where in 2020, the year? 20, the year. Uh -huh. 2020 is the year 2020. How old? Repeat it. How old were you? How old were you in, in 2020? 2020. Okay, guys, answer the question. You can answer it. How old were you uh, two years ago? Because now we are in 2002. I was 27, 26. Okay, you, Ingrid, you were 26. Uh -huh, Daniel? I was 24. 24, okay, younger, but hoping, okay. Uh -huh. I was 20 years old. Okay, Karen, ah, that means that you are 22. You are 22. I was 21 or old. In 2020, 2020. Okay, okay, great, okay. <laughs> Yes, uh, who spoke? Who spoke? I didn't see. I heard a gentleman. I heard a gentleman. Who spoke? Who spoke? Who spoke? Who spoke? Tell me, tell me. Okay. Uh, Marvin and you, how old were you in two years ago? 2020. Um, 30. No. 13. Thir 13. 13. 13. 13. Microphone, microphone, microphone is not activated. 13. Ah, 30. 30. Okay, repeat 30. But 13, no, it, 13 is too young for you. <laughs> okay, I was, but remember, the complete structure is with the verb to be in simple past is. I, 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 I was, I was I because was. we are talking in past. Yeah, we're talking in past. Okay, very good. Uh, let's see. Next question. Uh, help me, please. Uh, 12 is in class yet. Hmm. Maritza, you see Maritza there. Okay, what number, Maritza? What number? What? Two. Okay, number two. Read the question, please. Oh, Very okay. easy. <laughs> Who was? Yes. Who was? Repeat. Who was? Can you think? Who was? And the answer, guys. What is the answer? He was a Mexican actor. He was a Mexican actor, of course. Okay. Next number. Next number. Nine. Nine. Okay. Number nine. Question. Where you sick last week? Okay. Where you sick last week? Where you sick last week? Okay. Yes. yes. I don't hear you with the correct phrase. Okay. Yes. I. I was sick the last week. Okay, yes, I was. Only yes, I was is enough, and that is the correct, the correct answer. Okay, any mistake in the question or the question is correct? Is the question correct or, or not? There is a mistake. What is a mistake? What is a mistake? Oh, okay. So there is no WH question. Is Close, it should be close question, but we don't need the letter H, okay? Uh, letter H is not 
He's not doing anything there. He shouldn't, he shouldn't be there. No debería estar ahí. Okay, is where, where to be? Because this where is for places. Okay, that is a mistake, correct. Okay, you can identify when the question is incorrect or correct. Okay, three numbers, three numbers. Last set, three numbers. 10. Okay. 10, number 10, mm -hmm. question. Huh? Was it what? Sunday yesterday? Was it Sunday yesterday? And the answer is? Yes. Yes, it was. It was. Yes, it was. Correct. Yeah. Very good. Okay. Two numbers. Two, only two. Eight. Eight. Mm -hmm. Where, where, where are you yesterday, yesterday in the morning? Ah, uh, yesterday in the morning, I was at home. I was at home yesterday. In the morning. Home. Yes, I was correct. And the last one is number four. four. Number four. Where were where born? Where were you born? Okay, where were you born? Answer, answer, answer. Okay, I was in San Salvador. Born in San Salvador. I was in Italy. In Italy. Hey, are you Italian? Are you Italian? Really? No, I, no, I, I guess my you're kidding. Yeah, okay, I, okay. Okay, I guess you're kidding. Okay, perfect, guys. Great, excellent. Okay, very good. That was an exercise to see to see and to check how you were doing with the simple pass of the verb to be. And I can see that you dominated already. Okay, that's only practice what you need. Solo practica, yeah. Okay, only practice and that's it. And you can pass to the next level. To the next level. Okay, perfect. That was the game. Okay. Uh, be careful with the microphone, please. Microphone. Mic Ronald, your microphone is activated. Okay, thank you. Okay. Uh, let me let me look for guys the information about the next model. Not the next model the the complete selection of the of the next uh, the next part let me look for the information it was sent in here it was sent i don't find it just give me one moment because uh, because of the vacation you need to complete the section 5 in the final exam by Wednesday, para el miércoles, because of the vacation. Let me look for the, the information. Okay, just a moment. I guess I saw it, I saw it somewhere. Okay, let's see. Hey, I don't see the picture. Okay, do you have any any question, guys, in this moment? Any question, doubts about anything? Hello, question, no, no questions. Okay, okay, I have the information. I will share the screen again. Okay, it will tell me one minute. Okay, do you see it? Yes? Yes, yes. Do you? Yes, yes, I see. Okay, perfect. Okay, uh, week four, we are in the week four already. Section five and final exam, you can or you should finish them by, when is, when is July 28th? When is July 28th? Is Thursday. 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 For Thursday, okay? According with this information, you need to finish the section five and the final exam by Thursday 28. Okay, that is a date. Thursday 28, that we finish. That is a date. Understood? Yes. Got it? Got it? Got it? 
Yes, it's play. Okay. Yes, yes. Okay, yes, 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 yes. perfect, perfect. Okay, if you finished, it's more than excellent. Okay, you only need to be in class until Friday, Friday, no Friday, no Thursday, until Thursday. And that was it. Okay, thank you guys for joining to the class. Have a great night. See you tomorrow, tomorrow, Tuesday, in the same channel at this time. Bye, teacher. Good See night. you. Have a great <laughs> night. Take care. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Bye bye. Good Have night. a great night, guys. Good night. Excellent. Good Have tomorrow. a great night. See you good tomorrow. Night. Good night. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. Very nice. Very good. Thank you very much. See you. See you guys. Bye bye. Take care.